faut rappeler que l'objectif de ce projet, c'est vraiment aider à comprendre mieux l'interaction entre l'extraction de ces mines et la santé, de sorte à ce que les effets négatifs soient minimisés et que les effets positifs soient potentialisés, ce qui pourrait contribuer au développement. The team pursued a bottom-up approach where the field teams visited four countries in the African continent, which are Burkina Faso, Ghana, Tanzania and Mozambique. And in each of these countries, the team invited stakeholders from the communities, stakeholders from the health sectors, local administration, as well as the mining companies. And were invited to produce and give their perspective on the various impacts on the industries on health. We are working with DHIS2 Data, which is a data collection and management platform that is open source and it is uh, now available in over 67 low and middle income countries across both Sub-Saharan Africa and also the world. We are able to triangulate our qualitative data results with our quantitative data results, enabling us to compare and contrast our findings from both of these data sources, both within each country and then across different countries. Together with our research partners in the four countries, we first conducted a mapping of the licensing process to understand how health is integrated into the licensing process. And secondly, we conducted a political economy analysis to understand how uh, these regulations are also implemented in the kind of daily practice of granting licenses. And the result of that will be used as an input into a policy dialogue that aims at improving uh, the licensing process so that health impacts are better integrated uh, into this licensing process. Resource extraction projects impact on health of local populations, on the environment and also institutions. And that's why our research projects applies a multidisciplinary research approach and also it very actively involves stakeholders from multiple sectors.